can we let go when we're using the law of attraction? Oftentimes, when we're using the law of attraction, we want something to work out so, so, so desperately and so badly that we actually end up blocking the law of attraction. And that's why I'm talking about in this video how important the process of letting go is when it comes to attracting and manifesting what it is you want. When we actually have the capacity to let go and to be available to what is conspiring within our life for that particular dream, it actually empowers us to have more ability to to attract what it is we want and in a quicker way. So I wanted to get started with today's conversation with talking about how we can let go and let go just enough to allow it to conspire in a really magnificent and miraculous way in our lives. We want to remain open when we're using the law of attraction. We want to be available to the universe to conspire for us in whatever way, shape, and form feels good. We want to be available to whatever it is we want and how it's gonna work out. We just wanna be simply a vehicle. When we set an expectation, when we have a very clear, very like, this is how it's gonna work, this is what's gonna happen, this is how I'm gonna get there, this is who's gonna get me there, we are trying to direct our own path. When in reality, when we're asking the law of attraction to work in our life, we're simply placing the seed. We're placing the seed of awareness towards what it is we want, and we have an equal and opposite way of just giving our power to that source and saying, look, I'm gonna be a vehicle to this creation, to this miracle manifesting, this dream manifesting in my life, and I believe that you will conspire in the way that you feel fit, that whatever you're gonna have show up in my experience will happen in time and on time. Instead of trying to manipulate our life, we can let go. Let go of the expectation, let go of the need, and just be in alignment with the love of its creation. Be in alignment with the process that you're in right now. The process where you're creating it with in flow, in vibration, in harmony with the universe, with a deep knowing and understanding that what it is you want is already here now and it's conspiring for you in this very moment. Let go of the need for it to be in just right here in the way that you want it, in this forceful way and manipulating way and this is how it's gonna work and just believe in the universe. God, divine, whatever you want to call this source in your life, believe that it's showing up for you in a deep way because it is. And every single moment you're drawing breath in your body, the beauty of the universe is flowing within you. And that goes for every single dream you have, everything you want to fulfill in your life purpose. It's happening in time and on time. And know that to be true. Instead of trying to manipulate what it is you want into happening or how it's gonna conspire, just let go. Let that freedom in and allow the space for what it is that the universe is working on and conspiring through you to unfold before you. There's a difference between creating our own opportunities and allowing ones to unfold. You know, of course we wanna create opportunities in our life, but there's, you know, allowing them to unfold before us while taking actionable tasks, that's where it's at. That's where we're able to let go just enough to be able to create the experience in our life. If you feel like you're playing a waiting game, if you have these dreams that haven't manifested yet, and if you have this goal that you've been working on for years, maybe it's time to take a step back. Take a step back and look on what it is you're creating in your life and where you can create more space. It's through our opportunity to take a step back and ask ourselves, where in my life can I let go a little more? Because when I let go, I'm going to create space. I'm going to create space for the universe to come in and create miracles all around me. I want you to start aligning with where you can let go in your life. When we let go, we give room for expansion. We give room for ourselves to grow. We give room for the universe to be able to flow through us and conspire whatever it is that we want to dream. So if you have a goal or something that you've been working on and you've been waiting, you've been working towards it, take a moment, take a step back and take a breath and ask yourself, hey, where can I let go? Can I let go by just aligning with knowing that it's gonna happen, having more faith in the universe? Maybe that's somewhere where you can let go, is believing that you're worthy, knowing that you're worthy for this dream to come into your experience. Maybe you need to let go of your worthiness 
and not being worthy. Maybe you need to let go of that jealousy or that anger for that other person who's really successful at what it is you want to do. There's always space in our life where we can let go. And where we can let go and where we can identify with letting go, we can bring our awareness towards every single day. And once we have that power of awareness, we're creating space in our life for more good to align. And when more good aligns, our dreams come true. So that poses the question and I want you to take a few moments after this video concludes and just Ask yourself, where in my life can I create space? Where am I not feeling super good? You know, maybe there's opportunities in relationships or in your job experience or in certain things that you're not liking in your life. Where is there an opportunity for you in that to let go? Let go and align on a deeper level with goodness. Create more space so that the universe can flow through and create what it is you want. That is all letting go is, is creating more space in your body for goodness to flow through and to create the world that you see around you. I really hope that this video really just supports you in your journey with the law of attraction. I know letting go can feel challenging, but it is literally the most liberating experience of all time. When I was on my journey using the law of attraction with my art, I had to let go of my unworthiness of creating this life of my dreams. I've seen women's suppression my entire life and I didn't believe I was worthy enough to keep rising my purpose and my passion and my ability as an earner in my life. I had to let go to create more space for my dream to come true. And I would not be an artist, I wouldn't be sitting in front of you today if I hadn't of recognized and had the awareness towards what wasn't working in my life to create the space for what could and what would and what I wanted to work. So that's why letting go is amazing, it's powerful. I want you to make you know, maybe a list of five, maybe you only have one, two, 10 things, however many it is. I want you to bring your awareness towards those specific things. And I want you to focus on them every single day. Bring your awareness towards where you can align on a deeper, deeper level of self-love in alignment with this universal source that's working with you to create the life of your dreams. My name is Ashley Ducey and I love you so much. Thanks for being on my channel. I'm here to support you however I possibly can. If you have any further questions about letting go, please comment below. I'd be happy to answer or film another video for you. Uh, this topic is an extremely powerful one. Not only is letting go a process when it comes to law of attraction with creating your purpose in your life, but also in relationships, in cultivating a personal relationship with yourself and it's just a big conversation so I could probably go on for like 45 minutes but uh, I love you thank you so much and I hope you have such a wonderful day and letting go of those few things really empowers you with feeling lighter and happier so I'll see you guys on the next video and see you later bye Thanks so much for watching my video. Be sure to hit the subscribe button, press that bell notification to be notified every single time I post a video. My name is Ashley Ducey with AshleyDucey.com and I look forward to seeing you on the next one.